I need some peace and quiet. We've had people laying pipes, people laying cables, people drilling holes, lots of laughing and, and laughing. But yeah, I need some peace and quiet. So I'm going for some chainsaws instead. Come on, you. So this will be the second time today I've managed to escape from the house. This morning, Mrs P and I went up to Bristol, sorry, Gloucester, to her favourite little jewellery store. Um, photograph. To her favourite little jewellery store to replace her um, damaged bracelet. She had a whale of a time. I mean, she, she loves going up there anyway, and it is really her thing. And she did say it's kind of, quite possibly for her, going to be highlight of the month, or at least the week anyway, of going up and spending some money on jewellery. Uh, we did mention to the builder that uh, that's what we were going to do, and he did tell us that perhaps, really and truly, we should be um, not spending the money on jewellery, that perhaps we should save it for some of his extras. Not this time, Dave. So, um... <sighs> Sorry, that's just a customer book. It is it's working, which I'm trying to do from memory, off the top of my head. So, I've given him a week, not a day. That was my Land Rover. Oh, have they finished? They can't have finished. Oh, they have. they finished. Okay, so I'm not going to go to Tortworth and find the lads and see how they're getting on because I've just passed them coming the other way and they've obviously finished what they were doing. That didn't work, did it? Bugger. Now I'm going to get back here and find out that they haven't finished and they're going back. No, they haven't finished. I am going over there. Right, so it turns out the guys haven't actually finished at Tortworth. Um, it was just two truckfuls of sweepings and rakings to come back to go on the green waste pile. So Martin's still there, so we will go over after all. And hopefully I won't meet him coming halfway back as well. She doesn't know where she's going yet, but when she gets there, she'll be very happy. It's one of her favourite places because there's an awful lot of squirrels, tree rats around. And if there's one thing she likes more than anything else, it's a grey tree rat. When I say loves them, I think it's actually she hates them. But it sounds like she loves them. As long as she doesn't catch one. It was a squirrel. It was. We didn't have time to stop for that squirrel, but he did bounce across right in front of the car. And now someone's on full alert. Biscuit, come here. What's that? <laughs> What's that squirrel? <laughs> look, there's another one there, look. There's a squirrel there, look. There he is. 
There he is. That's, that's my ghoulies you're jumping all over. <laughs> right, okay, so this is the site of the beech tree we took down yesterday, and that's all that's left of it now is the stump. And we've not made too much mess out there. I mean, we did have a lot of rain last night. A lot of rain. So, yeah, they made a pretty good job of clearing that up. I'm sure the grass cutters will be happy. Onto the red oak. He's around the corner. Of course, he jumped right on my nuts for that. <laughs> Can't blame the dog, though. It was my fault. I did encourage it. So. I'm guessing Suzuki are having some kind of do up here. We're gonna find room in here. Hmm. On well, the grass, I reckon. Right, Mr. P. Ain't much left of him then. Six, seven loads up there, isn't it? I reckon, yeah. I reckon that load just up one there. That one? So I reckon two on that. Yeah. Do six, and it might be seven. I might speak to him and see if they want to leave it as a pollard. No, no, think so. It's all right. Hold, uh, Arthur. Arthur says it's all right. Do that. Oh, you see what it were about as it fell in the building. Yeah. He's enjoying himself. You want to get used to. He don't want to get used to it too much, mind. You might think we're forgiving him for reversing the transit into <laughs> Dave's truck yesterday. Dodgy, dodgy earth, I think so. Yeah. Do so. Uh, there must be a fuse, and we put it back together again. It all come on. <laughs> yeah. Right, Michael. Oh. Yeah. Well, he ain't gonna fall down there, is he? When he come down there, still on the drums. Oh, is it? Oh, he's that hollow, is he? Yeah. Up in that bit, but. Yeah. 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 Martin said you were enjoying my Land Rover. Yeah. Yeah, don't get too used to it. Oh, yeah, you been enjoying his TV. TV? Oh, yeah. His desktop box, whatever. Hey? That's the way you were. Oh, yeah, what Emma told me. Yeah. Emma said you had a chat earlier about my TV app. <laughs> All right. That one. Okay. A little extra. Got that morning. Right. Okay. Oh, keeping the guys busy. You right there? All right. Well, they're getting on with it slowly. Um, that's a big old tree that was. Um, Oh, originally we were having a timber crane coming in to help us move the timber away. <clears throat> Unfortunately the crane that we were employing um, got broken in a bit of an accident last week. So we're having to do it all the old fashioned way and cut it up into little pieces, ring at a time, take it away. So it's taking longer. But most of this stuff would have been converted into firewood anyway. So we're simply doing the conversion now rather than when it gets home. Sword dust stays here, doesn't it? Except that it doesn't. We have to rake it up and bring it home. Right. Squirrel hunting again then. Yep, 
There he is. <laughs> Please don't stamp on my ghoulies anymore though, all right? You can only stay there and here. You can't do that when we get on the road. What do you mean I'm encouraging bad behavior? Rubbish. I can see when he's right in front of us. He's right on the side of the road here. <laughs> oh, did you want to play with the squirrel biscuit? Did you? <laughs> she really loves it up here. Uh. Right, come on, you gotta go back over there now. That's it, we're at a squirrel team now. Go back and find out how we're getting on back at the farm. <sighs> okay, so more progress today on the build. I kind of left the Sparky alone because with him in here and the plumbers in here first this morning and Dave and Andy, it was a bit it was a bit busy in here so but yeah we got most of our ring main is in fittings for light switches we've got two lights to fit to the wall outside the main security light is done yeah the ring main is done pendant light fittings are done i think the only thing left in here now is smoke alarm smoke alarm i think that's the only thing he's got to fit it tomorrow and then that's first fix electrics kind of done. Downstairs. <sighs> We've only got one light down here because we're sharing the two upstairs. Um, one upstairs, one downstairs. So again, most of the first fix uh, lighting is done. Um, that's the mounting for the downstairs aircon unit. We decided to go with air conditioning as well in here because it doesn't just cool the place down in the summer if it does get very warm. It also apparently quite efficiently warms it up so it's like an air source um, heater as well. And because it blows air, it'll help circulate the air around as well. So yeah, we're kind of we're kind of getting there. So the floor's been set in for the wet room. That's got to go off. And then once that's done, this is this is the um, pan that goes onto the shower tray. And then when that's done, we then get the tiles and everything else on top of that. So still a long way to go. Nowhere near completion yet, but we're kind of thinking that we are on schedule and she should be in for Christmas. Should be. So... Right, Sparks is back tomorrow. Hopefully we're going to get a consumer unit put in. That's going to go in there. Um, we decided to put the consumer unit in where it's quite easy for her to get to. We're looking for a flush mount consumer unit that will actually fit in the stud work. Uh, been having some difficulty finding one today, but we'll look again. We'll keep looking. So uh, we can get one from Screwfix, but we can't get that till Friday, I don't think. And we really wanted to get first fix done tomorrow if we can but yeah so yeah that's the progress on the build so uh not a terribly busy video again today and, and no farmy stuff again because um i haven't had time for any farmy stuff today it has been all in here or with the tree team and now the phone's ringing so it never stops Me. Hi, Daddy. Hello. Hello. You winding my dog up again? Uh, she winds herself up. <laughs> Look at that innocent little little Mr. Butter wouldn't melt face. Look. 
Hey? <laughs> oh, now I feel terrorized. Mm -hmm. yeah, I do. <laughs> uh, to what do we owe the pleasure of you two both being here still? I'm waiting to pick my daughter up. There's oh, no what time you got to pick her up? Six o'clock. Okay. So I don't want to go home. Okay. And, and you're here keeping her company? I'm sucking your blimmin' vapey thingy. What flavour is it today? Mint. Mint? It's always mint. Oh. Mm. I'm a bit more exotic. I'm blueberry mint. That stuff gives me heartburn. No, no, that's blue raspberry. I've got blueberry that's, mint. That shit gives me heartburn. Oh. Mint. Is I'm it? always mint. Okay. I'm hoping to quit. I'm a creature of comfort, really. Yeah, quit. Stop it. I will do once I'm pregnant. <laughs> I did it last time, so I'm going to do it this time. Second. Okay, lovely. You just stopped me in my tracks, didn't you? <laughs> I don't. I don't so, plan on getting pregnant, so. Uh, no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't plan on getting pregnant either. Do you advise me not to get pregnant? No. Hey? Do you advise me not to get pregnant? Yeah, I wouldn't do it. So well, I you, just, you have to just go have it. So just have the one. No, one's too many. <laughs> <laughs> but I've got the one now. So I know. just have the one, or I have two. Oh, you've already got two. Oh yeah, that's true. I'm right. <laughs> <laughs> There's a Mars bar in that car, by the way. Uh, Yours, if you want it. No, when you. Yeah, it's my Bourneville chocolate still in the Land Rover. Oh, no one touched it. No, I didn't even tell mine. No, you're not. Okay. No one likes Bourneville because everyone doesn't like dark chocolate. Oh, I, like dark. I like dark chocolate. I like dark chocolate. Gross. It's yummy. Wild stuff. It's bitter. I like the creamy, you know, that's going to give me a heart attack. Mm. Milk chocolate that I can't have. All the sugar. Six weeks till we get married. God, I just want to be. <laughs> you I'm so hungry. <laughs> Please don't disturb really yourself into your dress. As soon as you've got that dress on, you're like, right, Mackey D's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You have gravy stains in front of it, are you? No. How attractive and charming could that be? No. <coughs> yeah. I think we should all go for a breakfast on the wedding day. Oh, wedding breakfast. A wedding breakfast? Early, just the family. It's yeah. not family yet. Well, you can't see before a wedding anyway. Exactly. So we should go and get breakfast. Stupid girl. Somewhere. So I can go there with egg stains in my suit. Well, no, 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 no. <laughs> no I won't be in my... No, we'll go in like comfies first. Oh. Okay. What? We'll go in comfies early. Uh, what? We'll Romper suit? It. You're going to go in your onesie, are you? And then come home, get ready, go. Oh. Uh. I can get rollers in your hair. <laughs> no. No, no. <laughs> Never had a good experience. Am I still doing your makeup, though? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. My hen do next week, Dad. Pardon? My hen do next week. Don't worry, it won't be as bad as it. What, the old lightweight over there? He did bloody well. Yeah. I was drinking. I know. Stupid boy. I didn't like that. No. <laughs> it's bad for you drinking. He doesn't it do it. It affects your legs. Yeah. He doesn't do it. So ever since being up here, I've... She said you tried to knock yourself unconscious on the shelf when you're in the middle of the night. <laughs> look at, look what he's done to his hand from it. I got my hand caught in the water literally I was like, why am I not going? <laughs> 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 oh, I, just, I, oh, I had to quickly hey, get him up. Again, no. We're having a couple of drinks too, so aren't we? Yeah. yeah. A couple. Well, they've just been up the street, haven't they? I don't know. I could have done that because I, um, I got the, got I get, bread. I get the bread. Oh, that's interesting. Right, yeah, I'll go and get bread, so I'll see you in a bit. Bye, bye, bye. bye, bye. If you keep turning the key, it will start. Okay, so it is Wednesday evening, and as per every Wednesday, occasionally Tuesday, trip into town to go and pick up the waste bread from the local bakers. And it does them a favour because it gets rid of their waste, cuts down on their... Um, costs and it gives me a cheap feed for my poultry so it's a mutual beneficial thing and then when I get a bit of a surplus of goose eggs I tend to take goose eggs for them and they either use them for cakes and bakes or then they sell some as well obviously no goose eggs this time of year though days are a bit short 